What exactly are Easter eggs? When you think of Easter eggs, you immediately think of the Easter Bunny. But did you know Easter eggs is also a video game term used to describe all of those intentional hidden messages, inside jokes, cheats, and features placed inside of a video game by developers? As you can see here, this is an early version of game testers and developers hunting for easter eggs on the Intellivision. Some early examples of easter eggs takes you all the way back to the Atari 2600 where you might not expect to see any easter eggs due to the simplistic gameplay. However, you might be surprised to find a hidden message while playing Adventure on Atari 2600. Perhaps you will be shocked to see a surprise appearance of Indiana Jones in the E.T. video game on Atari 2600. One of the earliest hardware easter eggs was a hidden snail game that was built inside the Sega Master System. In order to play it, you must turn the console on with no cartridge. Once the console is on, it will instruct you to turn the console back off and to insert in a cartridge. Instead of turning the console off, you hold up, A, and B together, and then all of a sudden, the screen will slide over, and then voila, you have a hidden snail video game built into the Sega Master System one of the coolest old easter eggs that exists. As video games progressed into the 16-bit era, 
Easter eggs also progressed into more creative hidden secrets. Sometimes the smallest details on a texture reveals an Easter egg. For example, Aladdin on the PC shows secret images of different Disney characters in a portion of the game. Perhaps playing Blood on the PC, you might run into another character from another shooting game, such as Duke Nukem, who looks like he's having a very, very bad day. Sometimes if the time is right, you may see things out of the ordinary, such as this Godzilla Super Nintendo game. When Mothra and Godzilla battle to the 32nd mark, you will see a space vehicle flying in the background. You might be surprised to find this in an RPG video game. Now that's very naughty. Perhaps you like racing games, but instead of winning trophies, you win your very own head. Check that out. Easter egg video game introductions became possible during the 16-bit era such as this Mortal Kombat 2 introduction for the Super Nintendo. You weak, pathetic fool. All too easy. Maybe Street Fighter 2 is your type of fighting game instead of Mortal Kombat. But wait, you're playing Mega Man. Oh, that's no problem. The Hadouken Easter Egg has you covered. Progressing into the era where 3D gaming has become mainstream, and 2D games have reached their limitations, the possibility of Easter Eggs became more possible than ever before. If you are a fan of RPG games, you might have spent countless hours playing these games without noticing the littlest easter eggs, such as these little wandering characters that appear on Final Fantasy VI loading screen on the PlayStation. Or how about Tales of Fantasia? The last thing you would expect is a Ridge Racer easter egg in an RPG video game, but somehow it exists. Speaking of racing games, over on the Sega Saturn, you might be familiar with Daytona USA. In this game, there is an easter egg allowing you to race as a horse, if you feel like horsing around. Speaking of the Sega Saturn, 
If you set your clock to Thanksgiving in the settings and play the first person shooter game Exhumed, you will get a nice little surprise from the developers. Check out that mug. Or perhaps you were a Nintendo 64 gamer. You might be familiar with Battletoons Global Assault. In this game, if you blow up a particular car, you get a whole bunch of messages from the developers that developed the game. Maybe you were a Dreamcast gamer. Have you ever played the game Slave Zero? If you played around with this game with the camera angles, you will see very strange images that the developers added into the game. Now I'm not sure what that is, but it's a little strange. One of the most famous easter eggs of all time would have to be the GameCube startup. If you hold down the Z button on one controller, two controllers, three controllers, you will get different startup sounds once you start the game. <laughs> Sometimes you might find an easter egg in the most unexpected locations. Check out this conversation between two scientists using the bathroom in Half-Life for the PlayStation 2. I believe something smells quite foul here. You are completely wrong. What is that stench? I must remember to report that fluctuation. Easter eggs still exist in today's video games. Probably one of the most famous Easter eggs in modern gaming would have to be the ability to strike a 100 pin bowling round simply by rolling the ball at the side of the bowling lane in the video game known as Wii Sports. Another interesting easter egg that will go down in history as one of the most controversial easter eggs of all time is featured in a PlayStation 3 exclusive game known as Infamous 2 in which they make fun of the Xbox 360. Whether it is the past or the present Easter eggs will always be a part of video games. It's your job to find them.